The pH meter is an essential tool in hydroponic gardening, so it is important to know how to calibrate it, especially when you first receive it. Also, when you have used your pH meter for so long, like in my case, this particular meter has been used for more than three months now, I will also need to calibrate it. Now this type of pH meter is very popular and is easily purchased online. It has an accuracy of plus or minus 0.1, so it is not as accurate as those used in a science or research environment, but it's good enough for hydroponic gardening. This kind of pH meter comes with three sachets that will need to be mixed with 250 ml of distilled water to create a buffer solution for calibration. Now these sachets may also be purchased online as a set. So I have three glass containers, each filled with 250 ml of distilled water for my sachets. Here is the 6.86 sachet being placed on the first glass of distilled water, followed by the 4.0 on the second glass, and then the 9.18 on the third glass. Make sure you mix the solution thoroughly. All right, so this is how we calibrate. I'm gonna turn on the on button and dip the meter reader on the first solution of 6.86. Now when you want to calibrate, you will depress the cal button for three seconds. One, two, three, release. You'll see the 6.86 blinking and you will press the cal when it's stable, like now. Okay, so it stopped blinking at 6.86 and I pressed the cal button and now I can press the off. So to calibrate on the next solution of the 4.0, before you do so, you need to clean it up. So I'm cleaning the sensor with distilled water. And after doing so, we will now proceed to the 4.0 test or calibration. So over here, I will turn it on once more, like what I've done. Dip it in, press the cow button for three seconds. One, two, three, release and wait for the blink to be stable at 4.0. Okay, so it, it didn't, it's showing 3.92, so I'm not happy with that at all. I will press the cow button once again, depress it for three seconds, one, two, three, to calibrate. It will blink, four, 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 and when it's stable at 3.99, that's fine with me, I just press the cow button. And so it's about 0 0.01, 0 0.02 off, but really that's not bad for me. Okay, so the next solution that we want to calibrate is the 9.18. And again, before doing so, you will need to clean your sensor with distilled water, like what I'm doing right now. And then I could proceed by calibrating once more. So click the on button, dip it on the solution and click cal three seconds depress one two three release it will start blinking until it's stable then you press the cal button again so it's showing 9.31 and i'm not happy with that so i'm going to press the cal button again one two three release it will blink 9.18 and I'm going to press the cow once it's stable. So there, it, I pressed it at 9.20. So again, it's about 0.02 away, and I think that's fine. If I press the plus button, I'm sorry, the off button, I can now start doing the regular reading. So let's start reading from 9.18. Clicking the on, let's do a reading. It's giving me a 9.19 reading, 9.20. So I think that's fine, 2120. So I think that's fine, that's about 0.02 off. That's all right. I'm going to now test the reading with the 4.0. And again, you need to really clean this before you do so. So now I'm going to do a simple reading by clicking the on button and dipping. And the reading right now is showing at 4.0. 
zero. Well, now it's still going down at five, four. So about 4.03 reading. So again, for me, that's okay. 0.02 difference. Now it's 4.01. I think that's pretty good. Turn it off so that I can test its reading with the last solution, the 6.86, cleaning out the sensor. And testing it now by turning it on, dipping it to read. It should point at least close to 6.86. 86. So it's showing right now 6.84, 85, 86. Okay, so I think this, this meter has been calibrated. It's off between 0 0.01 to 0 0.03 between the three solutions. And I think that's accurate enough for me. Thank you for watching Journey to Hydroponics. Take care.